Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're watching me from. I welcome you to Tap Chase TV. Today, I bring you another news, another gist from Jennifer. The family reacted to the ongoing general gist people have been saying on social media. But to be frank, I don't know why a lot of people divide, find it so easy for them to spread bad news negative news and this channel is all about good news we don't we don't say anything bad about anybody so yeah in this video you're going to be hearing the whole truth about genevieve health so don't forget to subscribe like and share and to my returning subscribers i say thank you okay just because Jennifer did not attend Ineido's 40th birthday and and um Rita Dominic's wedding doesn't mean that something is happening to Genevieve or as we all know Genevieve is a private person. She likes she's a very, very good actor and actress and she's very private. If you know her, she doesn't bring her things out there. So for this lover to come out and start bringing out news regarding that she's in the hospital, she's this, she's that, I don't think it's proper. Even if she was sick, you shouldn't bring negativity, you shouldn't bring something that is not nice to the social media. Well, everybody is also carrying the same news. Okay, so please comment below and let's dialogue into this matter. What do you think about the whole gist as I continue? Because popular Nollywood actress Toto DK in a post on social media spoke on how Genevieve Naji has treated her since they both met while reacting to news making rounds on social media that the actress has been hospitalized in US over drug induced psychosis. Recalled yesterday, May 10, on Ist one Instagram blogger, Gist Lover, in a post claimed that Genevieve Naji has been hospitalized in Austin, Texas, U.S. over mental issue caused by regular intake of hard drug. Why do people derive this by, um, saying things? Even if something like this is happening, this should not come out from it shouldn't come out on must they say it out on social media no however the actress reacted to the trending conversation about via the easter story section of her verified instagram as she shared a short video of her doing some painting work and has made nature nice clueless of what is actually going on because the actress didn't utter a word. We hadn't to this report to DK reacted out to the actress via an Instagram post where she recounted how Jennifer treated her as a younger sister and professed unending love for her. She wrote, Since the day you treated me like a younger sister and not a fan nor junior colleague i knew i would love you forever to know you is to deeply love you mama it's on a post on it's on a post on instagram okay so another person that said that reacted to this is another reaction is a lot of people were saying on social media Following the sad news of a ordinary actress, Genevieve Nadi is reportedly down with mental health. Concerned different stories, right? And a lot of comments were on Instagram saying if this is if this is true, it is so sad. And some people said must to publish it if they are hiding it. Which is true, must they publish it? So I love what Georgina Oa said. She spoke out. She said Georgina Oa speaks on Genevieve Nadi medication medical condition. Okay? And she said
Georgina Oa condemned how people are discussing the alleged health condition of her colleague Jennifer Inadi online. According to to all to Georgina, health practitioner who leaks her health status to the public are committing a criminal offense. Nigerians to sign she called out Nigerians to sign a non disclosure agreement anytime to approach a hospital for treatment. The actress in a post on a social media platform wrote, We need to be very wary of the kind of information we consume on social media. Most often they are lies from the pit of hell. I have known and worked with Jenny for over twenty something years even before the industry was called Nollywood. We enjoyed our 90s working so hard entertaining African. The last time I saw her and we chatted was in 2015, a sweet and kind soul. I do not know anything regarding her private or personal life and don't have anything to say that effect or I don't believe, I don't believe the everything that has been posted online so don't expect anything from this post other than me saying that what is being done to her online is criminal it is what kind of defamation if you are a practitioner working in any hospital in america and you are leaking any patient health information to the public you are committing a crime any health worker spreading such lies has broken both the state and federal law in America. It is a hyper violation of the patient's privacy. It is punishable by fine, license revocation, and time in prison. To their Jenny's family, your child and sister have been violated with all the technical making runs on social media. Get get a get you a lawyer to hold all accountable for this man. It is moral morally re impossible to subject anyone to such query. Mm-hmm. Health information is confidential and protected by law. If you are a blog that has been that has posted this fantasy about this young woman, I hope you are on notice it is sickly that our people are cold and cruel as a health worker you took an oath not an arm whether they, this is true or not i don't know and i'm not interested i know that whoever did this has committed a federal and state crime their public figure in nigeria this this should serve as a wake up call for you or before you enter any hospital or do do anything with anyone nowadays please sign a non disclosure agreement our society has become so vile and clinical people now enjoy the pain they put people through they need to glue at the expense of others for expense of others for certain segments of nigerian society it is unfortunate protect yourself and your family so that family please comment below